I believe that we should all double down, triple down, on the things and strengths that we have. If you're in your 30s, 40s, 50s, or older, and you're really good at X, there's a reason for that, right? Conversely, if you're really bad at Y, there's probably a series of reasons why that is the case as well. So, while well, I believe that we should focus on what we're good at, love doing, and there's a market need for it, right? Those three is the kind of holy grail, the apex of professional career placement of where you want to be. It is really important not to hide your failures. We have all failed. We will continue to fail. And those of us who like to challenge status quo and challenge the way we've always done things and innovate and do things differently are going to be failing even more. And that is okay. That's part of being human. Part of being a professional. Someone who wants to better themselves. Someone who's looking for fulfillment, progress, growth. And on this journey, you're going to fail. So stop hiding them. Let's stop painting this picture of perfection. I'm not talking just about social media where, you know, everything or 99% of it is staged and fake to a degree. And I'm not also saying that you should walk around with a list right, chiseled on a stone tablet of all of your major failures in life. Not saying that either. But if you fail, own them. You have done something wrong. Your team has done something wrong. Step up in front of everyone and own that mistake. Don't hide it. Don't deny it. Don't throw others under the bus. If you know it's you, own your failures and your mistakes. Because guess what? We all have them. So let's stop pretending how we're, or some of us, or most of us are flawless and perfect. And everything we do and everything we touch turns to gold. Because you and I know that that is far from truth. Be humble in your actions but confident in your convictions. Move forward and you will find your place on a team where you are aligned when it comes to mission, vision, values, purpose, growth, motivation, and goals. And on that journey, as you, you know, trip and fall and you get up again, be proud of those wounds, so to speak, those scars, because they are part of who you are. They have helped shape you into the man or a woman you are today. So stop hiding your failures and only projecting this perfection which is unattainable. Have a wonderful day as always and this is the first video you see. Please consider subscribing and sharing it with your friends and colleagues. And most importantly, leave your thoughts below this video on this topic or anything else I might have touched upon in the past. Have a wonderful day. I wish you all the best and be proud of both your strengths and accomplishments as well as your failures and weaknesses. We all have them.